Well, Selby is eyeing up the possibility of a cross double here. The name of the game is to get that cue ball back into the safety zone, but this could go close. It did go close, and that's the problem. It's got so close, it stayed in the jaws. Let's see a demonstration here. Yan Bingtao's cue power. Playing for the yellows, no good, so. Well, he got plenty into the cue ball, but that took away some of the accuracy. And I think he's left it this time. Well, that's all right. Nice angle on the black. That was a very good shot from Mark Selby. Perfect angle just to drop down onto that red. Eight. Got to try and catch one of them reds half ball or two at the same time as opposed to one full ball. Let's see how he gets on this time. Again, unfortunate. Is he on that red to the left middle? I don't think he is. Have to be careful. Mark Selby, 16. So now the important safety exchange starts. Well, he's looked at the scoreboard because he thinks he spotted a three ball plant not quite in line it doesn't appear yeah it wasn't quite on was it but he'd be happy to see it find its way to that right hand side cushion that's two reds he's got on the cushions now and the brown's pretty safe so if he does get the next chance, it's not necessarily going to be a frame winner. Not this time, though. Didn't really threaten the pocket, that one. Yeah, refusing the risky pot to the left middle. He's got a 52-point lead to protect. for Yan Bing Tao on these tricky reds to the middle is that he needs to be aggressive in this situation. He's 52 behind, so I'll be surprised if he refuses this red. Yeah, that's the red. That's the red he's shaping up at. It's going to be difficult for him to refuse this. He's also looking at the possibility of the red to the top left corner. But like I say, we know he's got lots and lots of patience, but I'll be surprised if he doesn't take one on here. Of another possible, anyway, he's not going to play it, but I thought he couldn't possibly try and play that enough to pink and screw back to the top cushion. But can he get through to this red? He can, what a pot! Now he needs to be on a colour, needs a nice kiss! Well, was it nice, was it not? I don't know, this yellow would be tricky. Got an easy snooker, of course. I mean, so what? Well, he got the he has. He's looking just to catch this red slightly thin and bring the cue ball back to, well, ideally, somewhere where it is now. Oh, that's a fantastic shot. Deserves a little bit of luck here. Brilliant shot. And a good resounding top of the table from Yang Bing Tao. Yeah, that was a special shot, that. He 
it's just what Mark's, makes Mark playing Mark Selby so difficult. You couldn't have really got him in any more trouble than that. You just fully expect to have something nice to go at when you come back to the table. And unfortunately, he's too clever. Very difficult to win the frame Small. at this visit. But he's got a, he's a chance of getting right back in it. Wonderful pot red in the middle. Yeah, you're sort of forced into potting the next ball. Like you said, it was important he potted the next ball. So your mind's made up for you, really. But 16. even so, you still got to get it. And it was a wonderful piece of queuing. And Mark Sell would be thinking that is it going to be Seven. his night tonight? He couldn't have done a lot more there. And he just sees Jan roll that red in. But then he's still got a couple more if needed. But he's left a nice angle here. 20. May bring this red into play here. Twenty-five. Brown and the yellow. Very difficult. Yeah, he probably missed a trick when he played that red. He should have made, certainly left more of an angle. But having not got the right angle, right decision just to play for the blue. And this last open red. And slowly but surely getting right back in the frame. Just 21 points Six. behind now. He may elect to play for the green. Try and leave an angle to screw down and disturb the red. That's that looks about perfect. Yeah, it's a good angle. Of course, if he doesn't like it, he can leave himself a double, but like John said, it looks like the perfect angle to attack this red. Oh, that's good. <laughs> so now I've got the problem of the colours. 34. Yellow can be very difficult. To get up to the green. 35. Even if you've got the perfect angle on the yellow, you have to play it so much pace to get off of the green, it makes the yellow missable. Let's see how he goes about it. 40. He's reduced his arrears to nine points. Looks like he's got a nice angle on this green. So, very similar problem facing Yan Bing Tao that he's just fixed on the yellow. 47. Again, nice angle, but the harder you play this, the more difficult the brown is. Doesn't have to play for the blue in the middle. Obviously, it means he's hitting the ball harder. He can just leave himself a blue to. I have a corner, if it means making sure of the pot. This brown, to make the points all square, will still need blue and pink. Big moments in this match now. Massive frame this. Young mid 47. Close, but as we alluded to, playing them with pace, very difficult, but it's run safe. So this frame's still well and truly on. Yeah, just four points in it, so that pink is going to be 
coming into play. Mark Selby would like to be 13 ahead. With 13 on the table, but either way, he's going to need brown, blue and pink, as is Yan Bing Tao. Yeah, you'd normally think, John, wouldn't you, over the course of a season, in this sort of situation, Mark Selby would win a high percentage of these frames, but he's playing the wrong man tonight to make that a formality. Yes, and as we mentioned at the start of the match, the head-to-head, Yan Bing Tao leads Mark Selby 4-3. The main thing with this shot, you want to put as much distance as you can between cue ball and object ball. He decided there, and he's played it quite well, just to make certain he got the brown safe. But it's not really put Mark in any trouble. Approaching 40 minutes. I think that makes it the longest frame of the match so far, and by far and away the most important. Much too thin. Needs a cover. Needs a cover. Is he going to get one with the blue? Is he going to run on? Is he going to get the snooker? He has, you know. Fortunate there, very fortunate. I think Bing Tao can just get to the edge of the brown, but he can't see enough to pot it. John, I'm sitting here thinking he can't get through. Yeah, I know. And I thought, well, why is he playing it like this? I mean, if he's going to try to pop, maybe with a little trace of left-hand side, he might be able to just bend it slightly. If you could get your hand on the table, I'd fancy you could do this. A bit more difficult with the rest. Yeah, I think he can get enough to maybe turn the brown over and pot the brown, but I don't see how he can get any pace into the cue ball and get anywhere near the blue. He can not see the left-hand side of the brown as we look, so he has got a pretty straightforward safety shot if he wants it. But he looks determined to try and knock this in. just shows you we call this game about fractions if it had just Settle rolled down, on a fraction more there, no. he'd be able to pot this no problem good referee in that there from rob spencer i think Jan just cheekily asked him to clean the cue ball and rob said no not from there because just a fraction would make all the difference here I can't believe he's pied that brown like that. I don't think that's possible. It's gone in, and like John says, perfect angle here. Nine. Well, maybe he shows he can just drop this pink in the in the middle. Can take it to the corner, of course. It looks very acute to the middle, but I'm not saying nothing. So I didn't think he could pot the brown. Yeah, neither did he. But. Uh... In the end, he convinced himself, and he was right. Middle pocket, it's a delicate little shot. Top pocket, very difficult. Decision time. He's looking at the middle. 
He's now looking at the top. I think the top pocket is the one with less risk. I think if you miss it, it could run safe rattling in the jaws. I don't know why he keeps coming down to have a look at the black. He doesn't need the black, he only needs the pink. There's only two balls to worry about here, the cue ball and the object ball. Because he's going to play the pot, surely.